Welcome back guys to the video. For you another Umbara mock update. Uh, this is the third one uh, for March, I believe like 19th or 20th, uh, 2017. And anyway, guys, as you guys can tell, finally got some progress. Uh, so this is going to be a pretty good update. And uh, so far it's turning out pretty good, I think. Uh, it's a little bit of a harder mock than I thought. Um, and I'm actually not going to be... Well, pretty much, uh, here's the thing. I mean, I'll discuss throughout the video, but... Uh, pretty much the, the three ideas I had, and, um, I discussed it with a few people, like two or three people, um, the landing on Umbara, like, you know, with the two gunships, or, you know, with the, you know, probably 20 gunships, but with the gunships, uh, coming in, you know, dropping off the troops, uh, then, you know, the little hill over here with the, uh, Umbaran, like, hover tank cannons, and, uh, the Umbarans, uh, I was thinking about that one, the road to kind of the capital, um, or just kind of the road in the second episode, I believe, um, or the 501st versus 212th, um, that I had a few people tell me I should do just because no one's ever really done it, but the thing with that, guys, is I just don't think it would turn out, same with the first one, too, the first one, the landing, I think I just wouldn't be able to kind of replicate the scale, you know, of it too well, since I only have two gunships, and only so much room, and, you know, you kind of want to have one, uh, at least two gunships on the ground, you know, dropping off the 501st, and then, you know, kind of have a one in the air would be kind of cool. Um, if not, you know, just be two gunships, you know, just, you know, just straight right here, then just a whole bunch of open room, with the 501st. It just, it, I don't think it would look too good. Um, so I did that, or I had that idea, that had the, the road idea, um, and then the 501st versus 212th, which I, once again, I just don't think I'd be able to fill it in as much. I just don't think it would look too good. Um, so I finally decided on doing the road. Um, it's not going to be, it's, see, the thing is, guys, I'm probably not going to have the capital in here at all. Um, I might, uh, don't get me wrong, I might have maybe a portion of it. Um, um just like, I don't know, if you guys have seen Chris's, uh, Umbar mock, which he showed at, like, some convention last year, uh, I might maybe do that kind of building technique, or at least that color scheme. Uh, you know, I kind of like that. The, uh, the trans neon green with the uh, dark uh, dark bluish gray. I might maybe do that. So what I'm thinking about is having the road, which is my road idea. Um, tell me down in the comments how you guys are liking it. But I think, for what it is, I think it's turning out really good. Um, if you guys just picture kind of that, like I said, it's going to be curving a little bit. Going a little bit more till about here, I'll be having kind of a bigger area. If you guys have seen, uh, man, I don't know their, their new name as a company, but uh, XX Misery XX09's uh, mock. Uh, the road, definitely, I got inspired by him, uh, really, because, I mean, I've checked every single Umbara mock. Uh, there's one other really cool technique out there that uses the, uh, I don't know if I can find some anywhere. I know I've got hundreds, but the, uh, the 1x2 dark bluish gray slope, I could probably find one over here if I really had to. Um, well, yeah, I mean, just this and dark bluish gray. Um, some guy did it, he's a fellow, like, Instagrammer, I believe he's in Rebel Egg, too. Um... So you guys might know who I'm talking about. He used like four of these and he made like a, uh, what would that be, like a hexagon kind of thing. Um, and then, you know, he used that. And then I believe he used like black 1x2 tiles in the middle. Um, it was a smaller mock though. It was like just on like a gray base plate, I believe. So that's why I, that was kind of easier since like that technique is kind of hard to curve, I think. So like, I mean, I wouldn't be able to like kind of go that way and then, you know, go around like that. So um, inspired by, you know, the XX Mystery XO, XX09 mock. Alex, I don't know, it's, new, it's something company, it's, uh, I think they're in California, um, but we're also in discussion of, uh, might be buying a few of his uh, products, if I do go with this technique, I would probably get one of those uh, centipede tanks, um, if you guys know what I'm talking about, I believe they were in the you know, second episode as well, um, I might maybe have one of those, also the MHC, might maybe have you know that somewhere, maybe kind of just up by the, uh, the capital, um, 501st clones, I've got a real good friend, uh, Bricklover, uh, 24, that might be letting me borrow his, uh, his 501st clones for the mock, uh, sort of like I did, uh, you know, sort of like I borrowed Chris's, uh, Shock Troopers for the Nexus mock, um, pretty much how I did that, uh, which is gonna be really cool, it's gonna save a lot of money and everything like that, or, I mean, a lot of, yeah, time and money, you know, getting them all in, um, so if I can do that, that would be pretty cool, on Barnes, like I said, I might be getting them from, uh, Misery XX09, uh, he's made some custom ones, I might be getting a few, uh, a few of those, um, so, yeah, that's pretty much that, guys, uh, closer look at this, uh, I really do actually like how this, uh, kind of layering's turning out, it's 
kind of harder to do with black, but with like trans red. Now here's just one of these. I know I have more of these, but just some of the plant ideas. Uh, you know, you guys have seen those in all the mocks. Um, and then these purple things right here. That's actually very accurate. Uh, if you guys look at the uh, in the episode, you know, next to the road, it's like a uh, it's like a sort of like on Devron how they had the, uh, the little lamps kind of on the side uh, when you go into the temple. Uh, sort of just like you know, smaller lamp post, I guess. So. I used all the gems I had, and I need about 170 more, I think, um, to go all the way around you know, on both sides. Uh, because I'm thinking about having the road here, having a bigger area here, um, and then kind of going around, uh, cutting off maybe about here. So then, like I so said, in that back area, I can maybe do some of the uh, the capital, just like the side portion of it, not really a front you know view. Uh, maybe have like an MHC in this corner, kind of shooting down over here. Uh, I have to make a few more of these ATRTs. I'll think about making maybe five more, or probably four more since I already have one. Yeah, five all together. So that's gonna be pretty cool. Have you know a few running up. You know, probably have maybe two crashed ones, and uh, pretty much on the sides here will just be a whole bunch of this layering. Uh, some of that. I might maybe make a tree somewhere. I think that'd be pretty cool. Maybe back by the MHC, kind of in front of it. Uh, kind of just a black, the orientated tree and then maybe i'll have to rewatch the episode uh you know the episodes if i can see that there's any color on the leaves i mean i know they got a bunch of trans you know purple or you know trans neon colors but just really kind of so it's easier and everything and since i have a lot i might maybe use these dark red i think that'd kind of complement it since i mean it kind of goes with the uh the trans red right there so if i do make a tree or two out of you know black slopes which i would have to definitely order since i barely have any but, you know, say, like, I have, like, a tree over here, kind of maybe a taller one, then maybe a few smaller ones here. I think that actually looked pretty cool because, I, I mean, basically, I mean, because the road, I agree, um, it doesn't look the, the nicest, up, you know, I guess. Like, it doesn't look the most, like, updated, I, I think. Um, like I said, I just really, if you guys have any other ideas, um, you know, leave them down below. But I just, it just doesn't look like a 2017 road, if that makes any sense. It looks like something people would maybe make back in, you know, 2014, 2015. Um, so that kind of sucks, but I think if, the, if I do have to, you know, finally, you know, in the final version, use that road, um, if I cover it up enough and use enough stuff on the side, I think it'll kind of complement it pretty well and to kind of blend it in, not make it look as, you know, not good, I guess. Um, but then also, like I said, this will be on a brick world, uh, which actually, damn, I totally for wow, I'm, I'm an actual idiot, guys. Um, I totally forgot to, uh, you know, Technic brick all these plates, damn. I was just, just such a rush yesterday to uh, tear up a Nexus, which is all in those boxes, and then start this. So, um, yeah, I'll have to. I'll probably have to go back in because what? I don't know. I'll probably have to make these green. I'll probably have to make this one big piece, and then I could probably because I mean, as you guys can tell, those aren't covered up. So I could probably make those four gray basically separate, and then just make this one big section since there's not gonna be too much stuff on it. I could probably do that. Um, so like I said, guys, Scarif is still up. Scarif is going to Brick World, Ambar is going to Brick World, and uh, there's probably one other six foot table mock by then. Since, uh, especially if you know, if I can get those cheaper Ambarans, you know, get get them in quantities and get them, you know, hopefully a tad bit cheaper than you know getting the, you know getting the real ones. And if I can get those, the five hundred first clones, you know, just borrow them from you know somebody, or you know, just get them for real cheap. Um, and basically just have a lot of time. I just, I mean. This box is going to be a lot of repetitive stuff, I think. If I just have the time, I think I'll be able to finish it. So if I just have those three factors and able to get the right parts for the capital, uh, I'm not going to lie, this mock could probably be out by, I mean, I don't, end of April for sure. I mean, I got to say, probably May 1st, I could probably have this out. Uh, don't quote me on that, but uh, because I'm going to go back over to my mom's right now, you know, in a little bit, uh, place some orders, and then hopefully they come in by next weekend, uh, you know, the end of my spring break. Um, and then I'll be able to work on uh, stuff there. Hopefully get the road done. That's kind of my goal. If I get the road done, that's really going to look good. Um, and then after that, guys, it should just be kind of easy. So this is a really long update. But like I said, I mean, I pretty much explained everything. I got some progress going for you guys. Uh, so be sure to share this video with other people, you know, if they want to see mocks, uh, you know, um, bar mock. Uh, since, you know, after looking, there's really not too many out there, I'll be honest, you know, that are good. Um, like I said, the Misery XX09, go and check out his channel. I'll, I'll leave a link down below. Uh, he's also making a bar mock, which I think is about the same size. It might actually be a little bit, might be a little bit more wider than 
you know, a long way. It might be maybe like another base plate that way, maybe another base plate short. Uh, he's making a really cool one. You know, definitely a lot of inspiration from him. And, um, you know, very good person. Uh, you guys, like I said, you guys probably know him, uh, you know, once you, you know, hear his voice and everything. Uh, he used to be XX Misery XX09, uh, you know, back in the good days of YouTube. Uh, I believe, you know, a few years and prior. Uh, he's, you know, one of the originals. So I'll leave a link down to his channel. Um, who else? Uh, I guess just him for now. And uh, be sure to share this video around. Uh, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more. See you guys later. Bye.